Hey dads, today we're going to talk about Piglet's Big Movie from 2003. Uh, we recently did a review of seven different Pooh movies on this show, but I left this one off the list for two different reasons. Uh, one, I couldn't easily find it online at the time, uh, and if you couldn't find it to share with your little ones, I didn't see the value of reporting on it for you. Two, this film really struck a chord with my daughter Abby, who just recently turned four. Uh, and it really stood out from the other films, I think, so I thought it deserved its own look. Fortunately, now you can find Piglet's Big Movie online on YouTube's own streaming service, so the time is right to give it a go here. The plot is simple, as Piglet finds Pooh, Rabbit, Tigger, and Eeyore trying to steal honey from the bees once again in the Hundred Acre Wood, but they won't let Piglet help, thinking he may be too small to lend a hand. Piglet goes off feeling sorry for himself and his tiny stature and reflects on things like friendship and usefulness, with a little help from Carly Simon's music, which we'll get to in a moment. Eventually, the gang finds Piglet missing and try to find him by following a succession of drawings in his special book of memories. And while recounting Piglet's life story, they realize just how big an impact their small, humble friend has had on all of their lives and just how poorly they treated him by refusing his help. The gang set out to find him, only to wind up destroying his book of memories in the process, and fearing him lost forever, they create their own book of memories about Piglet, finally giving him the credit he deserves. Setting out one last time to find him, they of course wind up in big trouble themselves, and while dangling over a precipice at the end, they realize they're in need of just a little bit more help than they have, and who better to bring it than their littlest friend, Piglet, who they finally see adds just the right kind and just the right amount of friendship to make this group complete. When it seemed like everyone was uh, about to fall into the water and Piglet runs to the rescue at the end, my daughter went really wild for this movie, and the message of the uh, movie is so neatly tied into the action, so perfectly delivered here by the writers. It wasn't just the hair's breadth rescue, but the fact that it was the littlest of these friends demonstrating his value that literally had her leaping up and down on the couch uh, I tried to catch it on video while playing the movie the next day, but take my word, if she looks happy here, she was ten times happier the first time through. As I mentioned, Abby just turned four, and she's now quite conscious of her own comparative size at school, both physically and I think socially speaking, and that's exactly the kind of thing this movie tackles in a charming way that I hope put some of those fears to rest for her and for other kids. Our fast-forward warning is pretty low as well. I don't think we hit the remote control at all during the film, except I had it in my hand for a couple of moments of imminent danger, which amounted to nothing in the end. Uh, for kids over three, it's probably a straight-through viewing, and that's good news for you parents. Daddy's reason to watch. Let's give it up for Carly Simon this time. Uh, this is a huge foray for her into the Pooh uh, franchise. She does several songs which serve the story very well throughout, and if you stick around for the credits, she even appears in the flesh. Uh, singing a few good friends and seems to be having a great time. She clearly loves this franchise. Uh, she's done music before for other Pooh films, but this is the one where she really shines. And like some of Winnie the Pooh narrators over the years, uh, she becomes an integral part of the storytelling here. Uh, and it really wouldn't be the same film without her. There are great themes here for your child to grow on, uh, including an appreciation for the differences within your community of friends, and great lessons meant to build or reinforce self-esteem in our little ones. Uh, we liked it enough that we went out and found the DVD, uh, especially since it's not always easy to find on streaming, and it is out there if you search a little bit. That's it for Piglet's Big Movie. Uh, cue it up for your next Daddy-Daughter Movie Night. Uh, join us on Facebook, Twitter, and reviewsfordads.com, if you will. Please hit that subscribe button to help our channel grow and improve, and also hit the like button. Uh, it really does help. Till next time, I'm Tom, and this has been Daddy-Daughter Movie Night. Thank you.